what's going on guys in this video we are going to see how to derive the equation for the current gain now here we have the equation the basic equations are here this is i emitter current is equal to collector current plus base current and also the equation for current gain beta is e given by ic over ib now here we are going to write an equation beta uh, for beta another equation and also we are going to create another equation for alpha okay so to do that what i'm going to do is i'm going to rearrange this equation here if you rearrange this equation if you rearrange this equation instead of base current this is going to be ib is equal to i'm bringing this equation ib is equal to ie minus ic okay then we know that ic ic have a equation ic is equal to ie times alpha so if i substitute that one for this ic this is going to be ie minus ie times alpha then here i take the ie common if i take ie common this is going to be 1 minus alpha then we know that beta is equal to ic over ib and uh, ic is equal to ie times alpha ie times alpha and we have derived the equation for ib that is ie times 1 minus alpha so this is ie times 1 minus alpha here ie ie cancels we will end up with alpha over 1 minus alpha that's equal to beta okay now the next thing is we are going to create an equation for alpha to create the equation for alpha i'm going to rearrange this equation beta times 1 minus alpha is equal to alpha then alpha is equal to beta minus alpha beta and here beta minus alpha beta then beta is equal to alpha plus alpha beta then uh, if i take alpha common this is going to be 1 plus beta therefore alpha is going to be equal to beta over 1 plus beta and that's the equation for alpha now we have derived the equation for beta and also derived the equation for alpha i hope you guys find this video helpful thanks for watching and if you are trying to learn electronics there are a bunch of videos in my playlist i hope you guys watch that too and don't forget to subscribe see you next time